and welcome back to the channel on this video we're going to go for a ride in just a moment here on the Lear graffiti but I wanted to show you the motorcycle helmet that I have and use from time to time and I haven't used it in a while but I'm going to use it today for this ride I wanted to show you it it's the GXL GX11 it's a motorcycle street bike helmet and I'm not affiliated with them in any way. I just wanted to point it out to you. And I'll show you it a little bit here. And there's what it look, looks like inside. It's a really nice helmet. It weighs 3.1 pounds. The visor, if I can put it back down for a second here. The visor lifts up. That's what it looks like. Now the visor Uh, it came with a clear visor and the sun visor, which I switched over to the sun one because uh, I mostly do day riding. And uh, if you do night riding, then of course you're going to want to switch it over to the, uh, the clear visor. But it's a nice helmet. It comes in three colors. It comes in the matte black, which this is. And it also comes in a camo and a regular black. Um, I chose the matte black uh, for me and it seems to look pretty good matching up with the bike right there anyway it weighs 3.1 pounds if I didn't mention that already it's made of polypropylene and it's got some uh, vents as you can see air vents uh, and on the back got some and down here as well and then as you can see right there there it is GXL G11 and it is DOT approved certified and uh, so that's the helmet that I'm gonna wear right now I haven't worn it I don't know if I've worn it at all riding this bike and so it could be the very first time I've had the helmet for just over a year Um, so I got it basically at the same time I got pretty much the same time as I got the Grizzly and I like it the only reason why I haven't been wearing it a lot I've been wearing the X needle helmet which is in my link if you want to save $15 on that helmet I do have an affiliation with them X needle but uh, the reason why I haven't been wearing this helmet is because people were complaining that they couldn't hear me very well and I don't have a mic set up inside the helmet so um, that's the reason why I haven't been wearing it but today I'm gonna wear it and uh, we'll give it a go here and see how it is I won't do a lot of talking I guess I already had the battery on I won't do a lot of talking, but sometimes uh, it can get a little bit warm in the helmet. So, particularly now in the summer, so I sometimes flip it open uh, like one notch, just so I have a little more air coming in. <clears throat> That's what I have at the moment. But it's a really nice helmet and I wanted to tell you the price. So when I purchased the helmet, I, just over a year ago, it was in April actually of 2022, uh, I paid $65. I was looking for a street bike helmet and this one looked pretty cool. It had good ratings on Amazon, I bought it. And I just looked uh, today here to see because I was going to wear the helmet, I, I, you know, thought, well, maybe I'll wear it and do a little uh, ride and uh, talk about it. And so I checked the price, and it's now down to 55 bucks. And I thought I was getting a really good deal, which I did, for 65. Because normally, you know, street bike helmets, decent helmet is going to cost you well over 100 dollars. 
So $55 if anybody's interested in buying this helmet. I will leave a link in the descriptions and you can go check it out. Um, I can tell you at the time I bought the helmet, I accidentally bought the wrong size. I had it measured my head and I was going to get the large. Well, I ended up getting the extra large. And you know what? It's a good thing I did. I thought it was going to be way too sloppy on my head. It fits. I mean, if I would have got the large one, I think I would have had a problem. I don't think it were, I would have got my head in there. I guess my head is pretty big. I don't know. But either that or this uh, helmet, particular helmet, is riding a little bit, uh, or I mean, uh, is a little bit uh, small in their sizes. You know, they're going a little bit off there. But, uh, pull into here for a moment. Here's the uh, fireworks. As you can see right there, the fireworks are being sold right now. Pretty strict laws here in Oregon. I'm not a big fireworks guy, so I don't care one way or the other. To me, it's just blowing up money. I'd rather blow my money up on an e-bike or parts or accessories for the bike. But that's just me. But anyway, uh, uh, the helmet though, I did get the XL and I'm glad I did, like I say. Um, I, was, I was a little upset with myself when I uh, sent it. I tried to do a exchange or tell them that I wanted to exchange the helmet to a large. And I, I guess it was already in transit before I realized that I uh, bought the wrong size. But then when I got it, I thought, you know, I'm just going to try it on and see. Now that I've got it coming, I'll just wait, get it. And I did, and you know, this is the size I need. I guess I have a bigger head than I figured. But anyway, um, I highly recommend it. Uh, like I say, I don't have any affiliation with them in any way, so it doesn't matter to me whether you buy one or not. I just wanted to let you guys know if you want a decent helmet, uh, I would definitely recommend this helmet. It's awesome. And heck, it's only $55. What are you going to buy for $55? Not a whole lot. And like I say, I will leave a link in the description. Hopefully you're able to hear me okay. Um, if not, I apologize for that, but... Hopefully you can hear me good enough. It's nice to wear this helmet. I haven't worn it, like I say, I don't think I've worn it at all. Um, riding the Lyric Graffiti as I am now. So it's, it's making its debut as far as I can remember. I don't remember wearing it. One nice thing about this helmet too is that if you do any riding in the fall or the winter, and it's cold outside or wet or the wind it protects you from all that that's the other advantage to a helmet besides keeping you safe if you were to have an accident like my uh, buddy did recently um so you win in several ways and um we'll see what the sounds like if the sound is pretty good here i wouldn't mind wearing uh this helmet a little more often i do feel well protected and I just like the way it is with the sun visor you don't have to wear sunglasses or any protection for your eyes because the visor does it for you keeps all the bugs and all the debris or whatever is flying at you including wind away from you I've got the uh, visor open right now one notch so I am getting a bit of a breeze coming in but it's not affecting me it actually is refreshing And I just want to mention this again, and I always say it, but I got to say it one more time. This bike, this Lyric Graffiti is the smoothest bike. It's unbelievable how smooth this thing is. And uh, I guess you have to ride it yourself to know what I'm talking about. But it's, uh, it's awesome. 
That's all I can say. It's, I, I really like this bike. Ah, it's nice to get out here and ride around today. It's beautiful outside. We got a temperature in the mid 70s at the moment. I think it's going to go to about 80 later on this afternoon. We're uh, we're uh, early afternoon right now, or mid afternoon, I guess we are. We're about 2:30 in the afternoon here so i think it's supposed to go up a little bit more i think we're about 75 right now we're supposed to get to 80. so i like the 70s better than the 80s for temperature but well that's going to do it for this video i hope you enjoyed it like i say i will leave a link in the descriptions about uh for the helmet if you want to go take a look yourself um, if you like this video go ahead and hit the like button if you'd like to subscribe to the channel thank you very much for doing that just hit the subscribe button and also if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up here on the channel just hit the notification bell and you'll be notified if you want to comment on this or any other video on the channel just go ahead and leave a comment in the comments below and I mentioned about the Lyric Graffiti here. If you want to uh, buy any bike from Lyric Cycles, I do have a, a link in the descriptions as well. And I have a discount code, Oregon E-Biker Mark, all one word. That's Oregon E-Biker Mark. It'll save you $150 on a bike on their site. So once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time, Take care.